If a company issues a recall notice for a product they've put on the market that it's unsafe, it does not absolutely insulate them from liability thereafter, uh, not completely. It may in some instances. So in a, a good example of that would be if they issued a recall notice for a product that you had uh, and you got the recall notice saying, hey, we, we're recalling this product, give it back to us, we'll fix it and give it back to you or we'll replace it with one that doesn't have this defect. And you as the customer just to choose to ignore that recall notice and then get hurt, then you may very well have a, a difficult time holding that company responsible because you didn't comply with the recall notice. Okay, but the recall notice in and of itself wouldn't insulate the company from liability in all cases. Uh, let's say a case where somebody gets hurt before they get the recall notice, or in the case that we're representing a client in, uh, they have the recall notice addressed by a de certified dealership of the company, uh, and it's still and the problem still persists. So the, a recall notice may insulate uh, a company from responsibility for a dangerous product in some instances those being where the customer doesn't comply with the recall notice, uh, but not in all circumstances.